I'm so glad to have Vicki Whitaker back. She's the owner of Cardinal Selling and fascinating person with fascinating stories. So you've been doing this business a while. What are, what are the challenges when you're a, a, a small business owner in this particular market? I think for me, um, I had a business at one point years ago that failed. And I think um, when I started really getting in the groove with what Cardinal Selling Services was meant to do, I started really to um, kind of put my hands around what are the biggest problems small businesses deal with with getting in business. So, you know, for us, we're able to provide uh, really great bargain assets starting up, whether you're looking to start a concrete curbing business or set an office up, you know, we're able to really help people get in a, in a low budget scenario or just a smart budget, you know, like um, I used to hear this all the time when I was um, teaching and, and working that, um, and when I taught uh, law, law and entrepreneurship, I would, I would read this, that, you know, the biggest reason people f would fail is they st spent too much money on the startup. So if you're getting ready to start a restaurant and you're going to put 125000 into the contents, and that's kitchen equipment and the dining furniture, but we can help you get in for $35,000, uh, it really makes your profit come along a lot quicker. And that just makes sense, too. And I think it really I, and does. probably part of the myth is it's new and I want everything to be new when only you know that. Well, and I think a little thing, a little bit of what I figured out is some people just have the money to spend. But what they don't realize in a restaurant scenario is it could take two to three years to really get your cash flow right. So when, even though they had the money going in, they might have wished a year and a half down the road that they wouldn't have done what they did going in. And so um, I think a lot of what we do is just, you know, trying to help small business, uh, business owners be a little bit more smart about their journey. And so that the, the uh, asset side of acquiring, but the other side of that is like we'll go into companies and talk to them about inventory that they need to liquidate. So whether it's a restaurant that maybe has items they don't use or it's a big company that has an entire line of products they no longer sell, uh, we can help them with a plan and a strategy. And that's my real interest and you know so uh, one of the companies that we deal with the most um, gives us a lot of furniture so that's one reason so many people see us right now and know us so much for doing office furnishings is because we have several big accounts that we're helping them turn um, what they don't need it's obsolete inventory well and it's, and it's all beautiful I mean it looks oh my gosh nice. people come through our place and I will tell you our place is truly a destination so um, our, our warehouse is 19,000 square foot of beautiful items. <laughs> That'd be so something to see. It is, it is something to see. Um, I, I also didn't want to forget that we are doing an online auction through Sewn and Associates. Okay, tell us about that. So uh, what happens to us is that we have items that we start looking at that we've had them more than six months. And so we're really um, partnering uh, with Habitat on this one as well because um, a lot of the proceeds of this sale is going to go to Habitat. So um, anyway, Sewn and Associates, you'll find us online. You'll be able to preview those items all the way th this week till Saturday. And uh, when the auction, I think it's actually next week's the preview, but um, it ends the last Monday of the month. And so the week um, after will be pickup at our facility in Huntingburg. Well, th that is really great. And I'm seeing that more and more, even if I'm doing a fundraiser. They're yeah. all bidding online and bidding against each other. So it's the way of the world now. It really is fun. Um, and in ourselves too, we... We source restaurant equipment that way. We buy at online auctions. And it, it just, it's my gosh, you know, we can bring back items and sell them to a startup restaurant owner for, you know, everybody wins. I mean, we're, we're able to make some money on it. We're able to help the person starting up and they get some really great quality assets. Check her out online and get in on the auction too. Whatever you're looking for, Vicki's got it. <laughs> Cardinal Selling, <laughs> she's got it in there. You check them out online and see what's going on and what's new and what's going out the door. I'm going to come up there one of these days and give me the tour. I would love that. All right, it's good to see you, Vicki. You too. We'll be back with more local lifestyles after this. Stay with us. This portion of Lifestyles is sponsored by Cardinal Selling Services.